I have joined the agency because I am looking for a husband. I don't think I'm unlucky in love. I think I just have had some weird relationships. Um, and then I was really happy being single. And then I was raising my children and working. And then we had the pandemic and I realized I didn't want to be single anymore. And that even though I wasn't lonely as far as friendship and people to do fun things with and, you know, family, I was lonely for that intimate relationship person, that person you snuggle up with and watch a movie and who's, you know, I was lonely for that. So you know what I did? Oh, funny. What did you do? I jumped on a plane this morning at half past four from Marbella. Are you serious? To come and see you. Calm down, EasyJet. We've all been to Spain. Is that where you live? I do. You live in Marbella and you yeah. came from... I did. Oh, my gosh. I did. And okay. I'm still so excited. I'm very, very, very grateful for that. Thank so you. So thank you for coming to see me. Yay. How nice. I'm looking for... First of all, he has to be, excuse my language, a grown man. You know, I don't want, like, so, I don't want some crazy boy kind of thing. And when I say grown man, I mean mature, sophisticated, a gentleman, warm, intelligent, successful, kind, taller than me in heels. My best qualities are that I'm very faithful, very loyal, um, very kind, extremely supportive, and I'm a great company. Like, you're going to have fun with me. We're going to have fun. Um, and I'll look after you. What sign are you? I'm a Virgo. Virgo? Yeah. Okay, what date? September the 4th. Okay. I'm not being funny, but I married a Virgo whose birthday was September the 7th. Oh, wow. Oh, it's all ruined then. Forget it. How will I know will I find the one? There has to be some sensuality. So I... Things like we say hello, we kiss hello. You know what I mean? And I smell your cologne, the tone of your voice. If I love the tone of your voice, because then I'm imagining the tone of your voice in my ear. You know, so I, it's weird things that I, I like. It's not the obvious stuff. So someone who's rude to me is a turn off. Like I don't swear, I, I, and I'm, I, I'm not, I don't dislike people who swear or judge them, but it's just not my, my kind of thing. I'm not looking for somebody to sort of have sex with because I don't want to have sex with you unless I'm in love with you. I've got to say, you look absolutely amazing. So I, I, I'm, I'm shocked that you're single or you haven't been snapped up by someone, <laughs> some lucky guy. Oh, so hard to meet someone though as well. This isn't it, yeah, Because yeah. I don't want to date like my friend's exes. Do you know what, I've never really been chatted up. I know this is, it, uh, don't feel sorry for me because it's not in that way, but because I was like a child star. So I've been in show business since I was very young and I've only ever dated people that I knew really well. So I haven't had that kind of, someone coming up to me in a club or a bar and saying something cheesy. I might quite like it. At least I find it funny. 